Today on Review This Thing, we're going to get the CVA Cascade XT sided in. Okay, so this video is gonna be a little bit different. We actually took the CVA Cascade XT in 6.5 Creedmoor out the other day, got it on paper at 25 yards. That part went pretty smooth, pretty easy. So then we took it out to 100 yards. We were using these Hornady American Whitetail rounds and it was doing terrible. As you can see, we were getting like three and four inch groups. If you've seen our other videos, my CVA Cascade in 308, We've done four different videos, 20 rounds, so you know what a Cascade can do. And so we were not pleased at all. But we only brought this one type of ammo, so we didn't have anything else to test. We also figured out with this right on scope, we were not using the parallax correctly. So started all over basically, corrected the optical focus, figured out how to use the parallax on it. So we're back here today. I want to start off using these Hornady American Whitetail because I want to give them a fair shake and not just assume it's this ammo. But if we don't get the groups we expect out of this gun, then we're gonna switch ammo. It can make a huge difference in your accuracy. So let's give these a shot and see how they do. Yeah. Bottom right, left target. Okay, so it's a little low and right, but let's see what kind of groups we get. It was shooting low before, but we were getting terrible groups. So let's see how it goes. Sweet, just a little bit above that. Let's go one more. And hopefully that means we've got this figured out. That's our three shot group with these Hornady American Whitetail. Still not great, but better than what we were getting. So we're moving on to the normal Whitetail. We usually get really good groups. And so we're hoping the same thing will happen with this gun. Let's see how it goes. Bottom left. Okay, so that hit about the same spot as the first shot on those Hornadies, so hopefully these will group. You probably can't see it good because it's so close to the other one. <laughs> see, I think those are touching. Let's get a third shot. Okay, so that, ladies and gentlemen, is why you need to shoot out different ammos before you make a decision about your scope or your gun. Now we know that, in fact, yet again, the CVA Cascade XT does like the Norma Whitetails. Super impressed with that round. Like, we don't work for Norma, we don't get paid by Norma, but we just have great results, so we're gonna keep using it. But anyway, so we're an inch and a half inch low, inch or so right, so we adjusted our scope, and we're gonna shoot it and see if we can get her lined up right dead center. Hopefully it goes well, and then this gun will be ready to rock and roll. And it looks like we may have got it a little, a little high and a little left, but let's shoot another one to make sure. Those are pretty doggone close. So we just need to adjust our scope back to the right and down a little bit, and hopefully we get. Start, we actually decided to leave it up and down where it was. Moved it back to the right, just one click. Let's go. That'll be good for now anyway. I'm sure we'll do some best of videos coming up, but pretty happy with that. We're gonna leave it right there. That's a dead deer at 100 yards. Hey, thanks for watching our Cascade XT sighting in video. While you're here, watch a whole bunch of other videos. We got plenty you may love. Like this video, share it with your friends. If you haven't, subscribe if you like what we do. Also check out our website, reviewthisthingtv.com, Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Thanks for watching.